Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to do what what is in my nappy bag. Just I like watching other people, so you never know. People might enjoy this one. I currently have this bag here. I got it on Amazon and it came with a smaller one and a bottle warmer holder thing. Um, so I'm just going to go through it and explain what everything is in there for. So in this first pocket in the big zip compartment, we have a book. And this is probably one of my favourite books because it quacks. <laughs> I also have her toy phone. This comes in so handy when you just want her just to sit down for a good 5-10 minutes and just to be calm. Just when you want her just to eat. It is so handy to have. I would really recommend this phone. It is from the early learning centre and I don't think it was that expensive. I also have a teething ring because she is currently teething and is getting her molars in at the minute. So this is going to be very handy and it is a godsend. I actually got this from the palm shop and it has held up really well. I also have in here is a rattle. She has had this since she was born and has loved it ever since. It squeaks on the top. And we actually got this handed down from us and I am so grateful because this is the best toy ever. <laughs> we also have in here, for me, I have hand sanitizer because this is literally a godsend. And you can use this anytime, anywhere, and it is so convenient if you need to wash your hands and you have nowhere to do it, or you don't want to leave your baby in the pushchair because she might climb out, or you don't want to leave them on the changing table. Just get some and have them in your bag. I also have a spoon fork sort of thing because she is currently wanting to eat by herself and pick things up with a fork. And then I also have a pen. Because you never know when you really need a pen and it is just so handy because someone's always like, oh, have you got a pen? And you're like, yes, I do. We are now, that is everything in that pocket. We are, there's nothing in the side pockets. In the main compartments is where most everything is. Um, we have my purse for when I'm out and about because you, know, you always need your purse because if, even if you're going out for a walk and you need something to drink. It is so handy to have. I also have my organiser diary sort of thing. This is really handy because ever since having her I've had constant baby brain and always forgetting everything so this way I can always stay organised and keep on track of everything. I am not currently going out so out at the minute so I have an advent bottle which is clean and it will be filled up with whole milk when we leave the house. I also have her water bottle again with nothing in it. It is for water, juice, and it's the Tommy Tippy one with the straw. It's really handy because it's non leak and it has a little thermostat in there. Thermostat, a thermo cup thing, so you don't actually lose the coldness of it, if that makes any sense. It keeps the cold in the drink for longer. Um, I also have ibuprofen with the syringe. Because she is getting her molars in, like I said, and she's always got a temperature. And paracetamol just doesn't cut it anymore. So ibuprofen is a little bit more hefty and it does her, so it's even better. I also have in some wipes, the most essential thing you could ever have. I would really recommend the Nutmeg ones from Morrison's, the mildest water. Newborn wipes, they are so sensitive and they are so soft, they have no smell or anything. They are absolutely amazing. I also have her favourite cuddly toy at the minute, which is her blue dinosaur, which we everybody calls blue, with little soft, not I wouldn't say soft, but really nice spikes on the top of his back. I also have her snack cup, and once again, it is empty because I am currently not going out. So I would fill this up with little puffs or little apple slices or something, just to keep her going until we can get something to eat. You know what toddlers are like, they are always hungry when you least expect it. I also have two bibs, one mini mouse from Primark and another one which is currently stained which I need to try and get out and it I can't remember where that's from, I think it's from Next. But you can never have too many bibs in my opinion. 
I also have a baby comb and a baby brush. Her hair is constantly growing and is always getting messy. And either way, if you give her one, she will want to chew it and she'll want to do it herself. So it's easier to give her one and me do her hair and then she can have a play while doing it. Oops, throwing stuff on the floor. I also have currently two Pampers pull ups. There will be more in it, it depends how long I am going out for. Um, they are in size 6 but I'm going to have to go on to a size 5 because they are currently far too big and have started to leak. Um, I also have a change of clothes. We just have a pair of black leggings, a pair of red and white socks which do not go with the outfit. And a pink top. It looks like a little cardi but it also has a nice little frill on the back. Um, and then we're going on into the zippy part in the back of the bag. Not sure what's in here. I have some products for me. I also have a tiny little travel container, I would say, of Vix because she has just got over a cold and it's always handy to have in your bag in case some other baby is suffering with breathing problems if they have a cold. And this is always so handy to keep in because when you always need it, you never have it. So I also just keep in just like little tiny containers of stuff. I also do have nappy cream. I am in the process of getting some more. Um, I do use a pseudo cream, and I have swore by it since she was born. Um, and yeah, I think that's about it. So I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe if you would like some more. I am posting every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And yeah, I will see you then. Thank you.